So today I'm going to talk a little bit about the, the Magnum build, um, what's going on and whatnot. Um, we got a 300 front end, um, 2014 300 front end on a Dodge Magnum. Um, I don't have the grill in right now due to I'm still taking the bumper and stuff off of modification, trying to fit it better the best I can before I paint. Uh, we're looking at paint um, beginning of April. So I got to complete the insides and the rest of the build before April, before paint. Uh, we are going to disassemble the headlights again, like the last 300 headlights I had before on the older model and uh, paint the insides and do Oracle lights. Uh, we have a Tierra grill. If you go on my Instagram, uh, Vaughn underscore SRT, uh, you'll, you'll basically find it. Vaughn underscore three, four S. RT. Um, basically, we're about to disassemble this motor. Um, had a couple of problems with two other shops uh, with the motor. Did have a Hemi in there. Uh, was misfiring. Wasn't acting right. But now we're going to go with another donor car and put a Hellcat motor in there. I finally figured out all the leaks and what makes a Mopar run uh, with trial and error by doing this motor myself. Um, I got my own personal wheels that I personally designed from Amani with my names in the cap. I gotta add RT. So I gotta find a machine shop and uh, add RT on the back of my cap. That's my new Instagram name. And uh, yeah, that's basically it. Yeah, I designed it. It was originally a full face and I decided to cut it open and uh, made it open. So it's my personal design. When I did the 300, I kinda wanted to do the 300 dash. So I did the 300 dash. Um, Gotta get new air vents or whatnot. Um, we got the 300 cluster iPad Pro. Got a fiberglass. It, it's all mocked up. Nothing's official. Um, I wanted to kind of make the passenger like a cockpit. So I got another one. Um, since they snap off, I found one in the salvage yard. I snapped it off and put it over there. And uh, made it basically look like a cockpit. I'm still debating if I want to put a TV there or not. But kind of like that design, just nice and clean. With the back, most Magnums you see uh, have a bench seat. Um, still working with it. I got a wall I just built uh, for four Sundowns ZV5s. Um, they're kind of a little heavy, so got to do a little bit more bracing on the inside before I mount them. And uh, made the back motorized. This is not the design. These are the old seats. They've been tossed around and everything, so they're dirty. But marked in the end, they're in there. You gotta do a little bit more modification to make it like nice and clean how I want it. Um, I'm doing basically everything myself. I have a satellite dish. Um, it actually does work. So it is a working satellite track vision. Watch TV while I'm driving. Or if my kids wanna get in. Um, this is not all finished. Like I said, I've been building on this box for about a week and a half now. Um, I got my bus bars in, batteries. Um, about to make a battery rack, get this all locked in. I don't wanna hold it by ratchet straps, but for right now while I'm driving, I don't wanna slide it around and catch a fire by positive touch and negative. So yeah, they're very heavy. They're about a hundred pounds a piece. And uh, yeah, I never had to use juice, lose juice anyway. Have a Mechme alternator. Uh, which I'm gonna have to order another one for for the Hellcat and on the back of this it'll be high so it'll be another box just for the high so you won't even see that box and you won't see the batteries either um, I don't think I'm still debating but I don't think I'm gonna do it. it's just there for case if I do disassemble it it look nice and neat and clean it's a little windy today we're gonna come back to this but I had paint samples We'll just put them in here since it's a little misty and raining. And yeah, got another one down here. So basically, everybody's seen the car on my page. I had brandy wine before, but this has a little cherry mix into it. Wish it wasn't wet, but you can kind of see the flakes in it. it. Got a little wet, so you see the flakes. So it's a little different from my old brandy. I had brandy over Orion Silver. This one got wild cherry and brandy. So very bright. 
but clean cover. Everybody know Candy Apple my favorite, and this is my last round with the Magnum, so kind of want to do Candy Apple Red over Orion Silver. And that's seven coats, and this is five coats. It's a little brighter. Playing on getting the rims and all my chrome dipped in uh, gold, so I kind of like the bright color, but for a change, everybody's saying I should go blue. So y'all give me y'all's opinion down low in the link. And uh, let me know what y'all assist of. They kind of look the same in the pictures, but they're actually different. So yeah, got a little modifications. Um, I had the old Benz lights in the mirrors, but thinking about switching to the new Benz lights, they changed them up on the Mercedes Benzes. So yeah, just a little different mods here and there. I like to add. So this has been a long build. Only reason why is because had two run-ins with two shops. Um, had a first hell. I had a six-one. Then I went to a Hellcat, and then my whole car got stolen out of a shop in Arizona, basically, and uh, robbed from my money in shop. So dealing with court issues on that one. But as you see, we got the thirty-fours lifted, and got my name in the caps. Got the bucket seats in. Everything motorized. Got to take down the headliner, do a star, star headliner. Um, still working on my design on what I'm gonna do for the upholstery. Yes, I'm upholstering myself. I'm in school right now for upholstery classes. So basically this whole car is being built by me this time, this time around. So that's why it's taking me a little longer. Um, so I'm doing everything, motor swap myself, everything. Only thing I'm not paint doing is painting. And that's because I'm not going to try that. But, <laughs> but uh, yeah, that's the only thing I'm not doing is painting. But everything else has been modification by me. Um, the lift has been done by LT Customs in Georgia. Because um, I cutted it, but I couldn't lift it because I'm not a professional welder. So I let a professional do that. But as far as music and swaps, um, the modification has been done by me um, inside and out. And just let me hear y'all's opinion on what else I should do. And uh, stay tuned and on the bill. We'll be releasing this summer, uh, Hellcat, the whole car, all completed. So just follow me and uh, stay tuned to the bill. And I hope y'all enjoy this. Nothing in my springs at all. It dries nice and comfortably. Some of y'all know me driving from Colorado all the way to Cali, Colorado all the way to Florida. So ready to do my cross-country trips on the 34s. 